La Lucha, it's a 90 minutes documentary. It's a historical document about the longest protest by people with disabilities in the world, the longest protest that was documented. And it follows a fight of people with disabilities asking the government of Evo Morales at the time for a disability pension, a human right. And it starts in Cochabamba, my city, and they actually walk through the Andes, roll the wheelchairs all the way to La Paz, 360 kilometers in miles. And it took them 35 days. They camp every night. They have set camps and then they keep going. I was thinking that when they get to La Paz, the film will finish, but actually the film just starts. And I never imagined what was to happen. It become like a real David versus Goliath type of story. It documents the whole march, but it centers in four leaders, very charismatic leaders, like Marcelo and Feliz are a couple, and then Miguel Mamani is a very young guy who is from Potosí, and then Rosemary Guarita that is from Cochabamba, and she's a street vendor, so she sells things on the streets in Cocha, and they're all in wheelchairs. It's a long fight. It's a fight where you think you will cry and you will laugh. We shot 500 hours because we were there all the time with two cameras, and we also made a short film. I also went to Geneva with Rosemary Guarita, and we actually took presenting like a shadow report and the United Nations. We put a lot of political pressure. I don't want to tell the story, you know. So a lot of things happen, and a lot of things change in Bolivia for people with disabilities, thanks to the fight of the activists and the protesters and also our work. So I'm very proud of the film.